Hi, I'm Steve, and I'm with I-94 RV, and this is a 2011 Montana 3100 RL. Uh, interesting fact about this RV is that up until about one year ago, this coach is stored indoors. It's, it's so it, almost its whole life it's been stored inside. Uh, so that's really cool. It's in great shape, no compromises. Let's take a walk around it. All right, first thing I got to point out is that's probably the most beautiful Montana decal they've ever made. Probably the most expensive one they ever made, too. It really looks awesome. So, can't deny that. Also, I uh, want to point out it's got an electric on it. So, that's really nice and convenient. Uh, again, Montana has this awesome drop frame design, plenty of easy access to the storage, and this RV comes with a few little accessories like sewer hose and some hookups, and then that's a tripod so you don't get any bounce in the front of the uh, trailer. All right, everything looks really clean on this RV. The tires look real good, step looks good. The decals are in good shape from being stored inside. Fenders don't have any cracks. Alright, on the back it looks good. So this is just how we got it. We didn't clean it or anything yet, so it's a little dirty, but we'll wash it if you buy it, of course. <laughs> uh, on the back you've got a bike rack slash hitch, a little class 2 hitch for something real light. And there's a weatherproof 50 amp connection right there. Alright, this coach has elect electric rear stabilizer jacks. So it's a nice feature to have, real easy to use. All right, on this side, all the Montana decals look good. And uh, there's your water heater, your furnace, and real nice setup over here. You've got um, this section's got uh, where you can do all your controls for water, hook up satellite, winterize, flush the holding tanks, do all the stuff you need. All right, uh, on the front of the coach, got this more ride pin box. Everybody loves those. Makes it so that it toes nice and smooth. Let's go take a look inside. Got four steps, which is nice. Now this right here is your central vac system. And you've got solid surface counters in this. This gorgeous kitchen, four-door fridge, big microwave. This is actually a residential size convection microwave. And um, there's a range top and an oven. So just all kinds of cooking possibilities if you need that. Okay, that sofa converts to a bed. This is called the 3100 model. Um, I don't know the exact length, but these are, a little, these are a little shorter than a lot of the big Montanas. So a little more state park friendly if you need that. So two reclining chairs, huge window. So if you've got a nice pretty view out the back of your RV's campsite, you'll really enjoy that. Um, you got a freestanding dinette. Uh, we haven't really done anything with this RV, uh, or this, I should say. We've got, there's like a little spot here. Someone maybe set a coffee pot. So I think with a little oil that might come out, but uh, so that exists for now. All right. Um, this is a good setup, you know, where the camera is right now is by the sofa and the two chairs. So you can look right at the TV, get a good view. It's just a very good setup for entertainment, watching a little TV after a long day of camping. All right, let's go up in the bedroom. So just a really clean RV. I really didn't point that out yet, or maybe I haven't emphasized it enough, but this RV is in great shape. Um, on the front, you've got a big closet here that opens up, and then also this section will is, is storage, but it, there's hot and cold water in here, and it's set up basically for a washer-dryer. Uh, also in the bedroom, there's a flat-screen TV set up, and just some more storage, and the bed lifts up. So there's just a little bit of storage there, but here's the uh, connections for the um, central vacuum, and there's also a safe under the bed. All right, when you go in the bathroom, what you can get at from the aisle or the bedroom, 
Just a real cool, almost residential-like bathroom where you've got a, a foot flush um, porcelain toilet. There's built-in medicine cabinets and um, a regular vanity here. All right. So this tub is really nice too because it's a real low step in. So just easy to get in. Plenty of height in here. Plenty of room. I'm 5'11", so I fit in here fine. So this is just a beautiful Montana trailer or fifth wheel. So whoever gets this trailer is really going to love it.